You know what our refund rate is? Zero. This is the Sales Gorilla Podcast. This sucks, but this is a fact. There's a bunch of fucking sheep on this planet that are persuaded into buying something that is the perfect one-size-fits-all solution. Yeah, maybe that's part of their learning process. That sucks. I've been through it. We all have. We've all been that person that, ah, this will solve all my problems. Ah, fuck, there's work to be done. Yeah, that's kind of how life works. It is what it is. Here's what my question for you is then. As somebody who's trying to sell your thing and you're getting on sales calls with people and you're trying to weed out who's right and who's not right, and you're trying to, you get to the point where you're saying, okay, this is how I work. This is what I do. Obviously, it's not a one size fits all, but you do have to figure out the one size that will fit all that are for your perfect people. Yes. So how do you go about figuring out how to explain that to people? By really understanding who your ideal client avatar is, right? And understanding what your process does for whom. Um, I was on a call earlier today with a, a small group that I pay to be a part of and I pay handsomely to be a part of. And one of the things that was, was mentioned kind of in passing was upwards of 40 to 50% of launches sales are refunded basically across the board. You know what our refund rate is? Zero. So people from outside of my business look at us and go, yeah, but like you're leaving a lot of money on the table. You know what? I'm leaving all the headache, all the nonsense, and guess what? All the fucking refunds on the table as well. I don't want that. I don't want the headache. I don't want the nonsense on the back end of it. And how you get to that point is by understanding who your ideal client avatar is and then telling them the truth. Look, this is going to this is going to be a little uncomfortable. You might even cry a little bit. I'm going to make life hard on you for a while, right? You're going to go through some things that are going to suck. You're going to do some stuff that's not going to feel amazing. And it's not going to happen overnight because you watched a training video. I think one of the things that's lacking in, in our marketplace, quote unquote, is the honesty, right? And I generally paint that honesty a little bit bleaker than it actually is because I want to weed out all the people that are just going to, you know, oh, well, I bought your thing and, and you said it was going to work. Cool. Did you go through it? No. Well, guess what? Just because you're hungry doesn't mean that dinner's going to make itself. 20 years ago, I would have dealt with the nonsense all day long. Now, I don't want to deal with any of the BS. And so I eliminate all of it. Do I leave some money on the table? Sure. Do I ever have to give it back? Nope. Right? Does my shit work? For the people that do it and do the doing, it works. <laughs> 